bum, bum, ba dum. A duck walked up to a lemonade stand and he said to the man running the stand, Hey, bum, 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 got any grapes? The man said, No, we just sell lemonade, but it's cold and it's fresh and it's all homemade. Can I get you a glass? The duck said, I'll pass. Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle. When the duck walked up to the lemonade stand And he said to the man running the stand Hey, bum, 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 got any grapes? The man said, no, like I said yesterday We just sell lemonade, okay? Why not give it a try? The duck said, goodbye Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle, he waddled away, he waddled, waddle, waddle. When the duck walked up to the lemonade stand And he said to the man running the stand Hey, bum, 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 got any grapes? The man said, look, this is getting old I mean, lemonade's all we've ever sold Why not give it a go? The duck said, how about no? Then he waddled away, he waddle, waddle Then he waddled away, he waddle, waddle, waddle Then he waddled away, he waddle, waddle when the duck walked up to the lemonade stand And he said to the man running the stand Hey, bum, 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 got any grapes? The man said, that's it, if you don't stay away, duck I'll glue you to a tree and leave you there all day stuck So don't get too close, the duck said, adios Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle, waddle then he waddled away, he waddle, waddle, till the very next day. Bum, 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 bum. When the duck walked up to the lemonade stand, and he said to the man running the stand, Hey, bum, 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 got any glue? What? Got any glue? No, why would I? Oh, then one more question for you. Got any grapes? Bum, bum, bum. just stopped. Then he started to smile. He started to laugh. He laughed for a while. He said, come on, duck. Let's walk to the store. I'll buy you some grapes so you won't have to ask anymore. So they walked to the store and the man bought some grapes. He gave one to the duck and the duck said, mm, no thanks. But you know what sounds good? It would make my day. Do you think this store? Do you think this store? Do you think this store has any lemonade? Then he waddled away, waddle, waddle. That is something. The duck song. I only I was, I only play that up because uh you got any grapes? I got grapes right here. Um me and the roommate saw that and then we watched it like twenty times. We were both dying laughing. The roommate loves it. Okay, let's get going here. So I thought this was a hockey player. I don't know how I could, hold on. My computer, the, the top is a little broke, so it's not closing. I thought this was a hockey player. This is a minor league soccer player. <laughs> oh, that guy's awesome. And then of course, the roommate loved the chicken card, uh, say the other chicken card, he was very excited. So I'm borrowing him that from him. We're just gonna do a quick pickups video. I didn't want it to be too short, so I wanted to uh, play the duck song, one of my all time favorites now. Okay, let me move some stuff out of the way. Pretty, pretty big for me. Pretty big uh, update, update, um, pickups video. Not gonna open anything on this one. Um, I've been doing kind of where I do two videos now a week. And I do them, you know, I make them and release them later, almost a week later sometimes. But I try to do two a night uh, because it's just, once I start opening cards, I can't stop. So I want to do as much as one night and try to stop the other day. So anyway, you don't want to hear all of it. So this is actually Tuesday night. Thursday will be Thanksgiving. So you probably get this after Thanksgiving. Okay, I got a sickness. I have one more coming. I have another one of the blue ones coming. And the plan is, starting next year in January, I'm going to do at least one box a month. We're going to do a series where we hunt for the Sandberg Auto. 
and we're going to do it once a month. Um, it's possible. Um, I've got one more coming for. I'll probably pick up another one or two, but I really need to lay off the cards for at least a month or two. The wife's not happy, and you'll see why. Yeah, so I'll try to do a box of these uh, every month. I'm sure there'll be a month or two I do more than one. And then if we get to like November, December, and we haven't got any Elite or Sandberg yet, then I'll be ripping the crap out of them. So, yesterday, let me move some stuff over. I was like, I'm going to splurge today. I was going to get this wine. It's like I had hidden a box of archives. I was like, I don't love archives, but I'll get one box and, uh, you know, I'll do a video, open it, whatever. And I went there and it's funny how the archives, my hiding spot was discovered, was no longer there. I just caught a restock. This is the first time I have found these in stores. This is Donruss Optic. This is what we'd call a value pack or a fat pack. These are $15.99 a pack, but I, I, I've never seen them. It's the first time this year that I've seen them. So I got eight packs of these. This is like... Um, I know most people prefer like the hangers or the blasters, but a lot of people have said that they can get the downtowns really nice out of these. And then you can still get autos, you get a green... You can get... I think you get one green one like every other pack. Then, another thing that I saw there for the very first time. The mystery box. Uh, this is uh, MJ Holdings. You get three or four factory sealed packs. And you can get some amazing packs out of here. The Prism and Elite. I didn't see this pack pulled anywhere. Um, or that one. I did see one or two Prisms. And then I saw a ton of Optic. Basketball, you can have some huge hits. So there were a couple really nice packs on these. I think the first series of the was, first series that they did of NBA like this was three packs. Now it's three or four. So I bought one of these along with those uh, optics. I spent over $250 in cards that day. So, but I hid some other stuff. I was going to go back. Wife kind of wanted to go out and do something. So I was like, I kind of like, okay. I hid some stuff. I've already spent some money, but I need to hit some more. I haven't spent that much lately. So, <laughs> I went back and bought three more. What's number four here? These are 30 bucks a box. A little pricey. Um, but like I said, this is the type of thing that I love. And uh, I watched a ton of videos. When I buy something, anything really, I like to sit on it for just a little bit and feel it and, and, and own it and be excited about it so I don't open everything the day. It's not a control issue. It's not like I got really good self-control, really bad self-control. As you can see, I just bought four of these. It's just I like to have it for a couple days before I open it. But uh, a lot of prism packs coming out of this, some nice hits. Uh, there was a, I think it was like $140 John Moran out of one video. I didn't see any massive hits out of any packs, but uh, these are the type of packs you you know you're not going to get them in every box, but you can find those type of packs that have those massive basketball hits. And then the pack selection out of these, it seemed to me most of them you're getting thirty dollars worth. Not big on basketball. I'm going to need a little help after I open these eventually. But that's it. So yeah, it doesn't seem like a lot, but this is a, uh, a big chunk. A little disappointed that I could actually find these for 99 cents less per pack online. I, they were $15.99, and then I went online to see what they were, and they were 15 on the dot. But whatever. I'm not going to buy any more. I mean, maybe, just maybe, if I saw a blaster. Blasters go for 60 online. If I saw a blaster or a hanger at some point, I maybe would buy one. But looking forward to trying to pull a... Um, a downtown out of one of those so that's it for this video um just enjoying a nice drink um i messed up on my schedule because i'm a big dummy i thought i worked wednesday had thursday off and worked friday saturday i actually work wednesday thursday i misread the schedule so i work thanksgiving that's fine um with no huge plans anyway and uh very very kind of glad not to work fridays fridays are just a miserable miserable bucket of bucket of misery dumped on top dumped on top of 
fire. It's like gasoline on a fire. Fridays are awful. I don't know how to describe it. Fridays are bad, but try to keep this a 10 minute or less video. So thank you very much. And I'll talk to you later.